bring some roses, anything that you ask for. Play a little music if you want. So Abby's getting her lashes done for the first time today. That's a place there. Did you growl them when she was Hi guys, we're in Cotton On. We just went to this place called South Street. I got like a bunch of stuff and I didn't expect to get it, but it was like hella hella cute. Yeah, so like I was saying, I got some stuff from South Street. I got like a bunch of stuff. <laughs> I'm so rude, anyways. Yeah, so I got some stuff in there. Don't mind Abby's Lash shampoo in there, but there's like some stuff I'll show you guys later but I wish I showed you in the shop it was just like the pop-up of South Street um this brand which is I think it's an Instagram brand and they do have an online store as well so I got the mango sago and coconut milk can't wait to try this is um dessert culture in South Yara and I have a little baklava from the Pran market and my strawberry croissant that I haven't tried yet but yeah I'm gonna try this so I'm gonna try the drink. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Guess what I got? I got some one freak. 
think we're sweet and sour sauce and have you got some ice cream? Yeah, I have some fries. Oh, got a large fries. We always have a little oh. midnight run. But actually we can't go get junk food and snacks. So, yeah. Can't wait to take my makeup off and wash my hair when I get home. Uh, so rude. Anyways, very fresh, very crispy, very salty. So good to know. It's in this bag and you shake it with the chicken salt. It is so good and it makes it taste so much better. Bon appetit! <laughs> This one, Poets of Berlin, and room service. It literally smells so good. Hi guys, morning. So it is Monday morning. Sister is at work, and I'm heading out to do some errands right now for her. And also, I'm getting my nails done at Safiara. So I'll see you guys with me. have a think about I guess what I want so like which color to get So I've got my nails done. 
bit like an ombre with a little bit of like a jewel on my ring finger i just went into an asian shop and just got so many snacks basically i'm just strolling around because my sister has work today so it says it's coming in 13 minutes sunscreen so I am in Emporium right now going to Rational flagship store I just got my sister some really beautiful little mushroom cake thing it doesn't actually taste like mushrooms it looks like a mushroom but it's like a white chocolate ganache like rose water cake from Galax Galate Galace Glasser. I don't know how to say it, but I think it's Glasser in French. Um, but yeah, I got myself a dark chocolate cake slice. But now I'm just gonna basically stroll and maybe go home soon. Guys, this David Jones is literally unreal. I wish our David Jones was like this in Perth. It's so, so fancy. Look at this. So there's Christian Louboutin, Dior, there's Celine back there. They just have everything in there. cheese tea with sago and rice balls honestly top tea highly rate this is like my favorite bubble tea place it's so good wow this is so yummy apparently it's like fresh cherries that they get from a cherry orchard in melbourne it's like a famous cherry um picking place but yeah they like collaborated with top tea to create a cherry range and yeah this is one of them so this is yeah the cherry cheese tea so it has cheese um foam it doesn't taste cheesy i know that's kind of like a weird thing like when i heard that i was like i'm mm, not sure if i'd like that but it doesn't taste like cheese it's just really like foamy and fluffy um the top layer and it gives it a nice texture to the bubble tea 10 out of 10 for sure this next one is a place I've been wanting to try for a while called Machi Machi. 
So that's what it looks like. So this is one that comes in a little bottle. They do have different ones as well, like the similar container like top tea, but this specific drink comes in a bottle and you cannot add toppings to this. It's a strawberry latte panna cotta. That's what this one is. So let's try it. So she said that you can drink individually and then mix it together at the end. So you can try the different flavors. Mm, the panna cotta is very fresh, really, really creamy. Wow, actually, I, why does every single one taste so good? Like, I'm not even joking, guys. Like, these are actually phenomenal. I've never tasted a bubble tea this good in my life. I could have this for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That's how good it is. And I would crave this constantly. Actually, so yummy. I would say these definitely are one of the top ones that I've tried really really yum i would definitely recommend these places i haven't tried much from this place but all of the bubble teas i've tried from top tea are phenomenal i'm gonna explore more drinks from matchy matchy and put reviews on my instagram for you guys nine out of ten so if you're wondering what this little red flag is it's my rice cakes so you know how i said i got rice cakes in my top tea bubble tea this is basically the rice cake so you can eat them before you have your bubble tea or after, but yeah, they're just like little rice cakes on a stick. So yummy. So this is a um, spinach and cheese for it, and I just need getting a pizza as well. I'm heading home back to my sister's place. Um, yeah, short a day for me exploring. But if you're wondering, the shirt top um, that I have, it's from Zara. So I actually got it on sale. Um, shorts are a brand and my shoes are Alexander McQueen and then my bag's obviously my Louis bag that I got for Christmas and I have all my snacks <laughs> this pizza is so yummy I got um, a homemade pizza from this um, Italian place and oh amazing it's sold by the slice and I also got a Borek as well which I haven't finished eating yet, but super yummy also. But yeah, I'm just going to stuff my face and I'm going to try my bubble tea for you guys on camera. Divine. I love food. Oh. Food is the best. Cheers, guys. This is phenomenal. The whole cherry tea range from Top Tea is actually so delicious incredible so this is the the roselle cherry fruit tea with brown sugar pearls and sago 
So my other tea that I got is top tea as well. So this is the mango cheese tea with white peach jelly and rice balls. So at the top here is where the rice balls are. So there's three of them on a stick. So you eat them before drinking the tea. So yeah, let's try this one. Mm. I definitely do prefer the cherry one. So these are the rice balls here. Um, I love these. I also love mini rice balls. Um, Top Tea doesn't do mini rice balls, but there's some other bubble tea places in Melbourne that do offer them in the drinks.
great Kristen. Doing mm. Dubai, it's difficult. It was so yeah. hot in yeah. summer. Oh gosh, they burn, they burn yeah. alive. <laughs> yeah, and then you, you know, they. I've got a friend, a dog. He's got this old dog that's been ill the last twelve months, on and off. And this old dog, oh, really? Uh, but he loves the dog, yeah. and I, I'm yeah. kind of like, boy, boy, that's <laughs> like, you know, humans' yeah. medical fees. Yeah. You know, like so crazy. Some yeah. people just love their animals. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's true. Yeah. For a mice, <laughs> hundreds of dollars on vet fees for a mice. <laughs> <laughs> Is he up for the count? <laughs> oh my god, this thing is so cute. <laughs> yes, she is. So cute. Hello. <laughs> quarantine two days ago so we have just been spending time with him and today we're going to South Melbourne Market so yeah I'm going to take you guys along with us. Where's the um, where's the best cup of tea? scuffed my face with the back of the and now I'm gonna have some cupcakes that I bought so I got a strawberry shortcake and a pistachio rose water cupcake from the South Melbourne markets my dad left so just me and my sister now we might go to Chadston um but I'm gonna have a bite of this it looks so yummy Mmm, wow, super like moist, super light as well, mmm, 10 out of 10, so yeah, I would yeah, really recommend this if you're at South Melbourne Market, they have a little stall there with loads of different flavours of cupcakes. <laughs>
to, to put my seamless under. Where are we going now, Abby? No, I don't know. Oh. <laughs> I don't think I told you guys that, but we're at Chadston Shopping Centre. Oh, I don't know if you guys can hear me, but... Yeah, we're just strolling. It's so beautiful in the shopping centre. It reminds me of Dubai a little bit, actually. Yeah. So we're having my fave Legos pasta. We had the tortellini ravioli and I made some for Abby too.
Hi guys, so it is future Michelle editing this video. Super tired, back in Perth, a little bit jet lagged, even though that's not really a thing coming from Melbourne, but still very exhausted. Uh, I didn't do the outro to this video as always, surprise, surprise. So here I am. Thank you guys so much. Just for always supporting me, watching my content, liking and commenting. I appreciate every single one of you. And I hope you guys like this video. Stay tuned for my next video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.